Hey guys, <clears throat> it's been a while since I've uh, talked about my paintings and uh, my art that I do. And I know I have a lot of new subscribers, so I figured I was gonna share this. Um, a lot of you guys maybe don't know this, um, but this is how I make my living actually. Um, I do paintings and uh, I sell not only the originals, but prints, they're called G clay prints. And a G clay print is actually a, a it's a professional exact replica print and they're um, limited. <clears throat> so I only make so many of them and once they're gone, they're gone forever. And um, so what I'm doing here, we're at the church and I have this little display in one of the, one, in one of the corners of the lobby here. And um, it's time to switch them, switch them out. So we have a gallery in Stockton that carries my work. And um, so every once in a while, just to keep it fresh, I move things around, switch them around, add new pieces. Like, like this blank spot here um, was because I had sold the painting. And uh, in Stockton, at the gallery there, there's a few empty spots like that. So the owner was like, hey, <clears throat> we need some, some, uh, something different. There's a, you know, some empty spots that you need to fill. So as I was uh, about to kind of move things around and see what I was going to move to the Stockton Gallery, I said, oh, I'm going to do a quick video because I haven't done a video in a while. And, um, you know, to be honest with you, this is, uh, this is how I provide for my family, you know. So um, I just uh, thought I'd share with you in case maybe you'd be interested in some of the artwork that I do, you know. So... Um, I'm just going to go ahead and show you. I'm going to unmount my, my phone and I'll switch the camera to the other side, to the other way. And I'll talk a little bit about some of the, to, uh, some of the work I have here. I have other paintings, but like I said, they're in the other gallery. And, um, and I think I have a few that at home that I don't have here or the gallery. But here you just got kind of get a taste of what it is that I have. So check it out. So this one I have is actually called The Meeting. When Sharon first moved to Northern California, she saw this. This is a real place. And um, she was like, look, it looks like these little lambs and goats are all listening to the horse. You know, so uh, she wanted me to paint it. The original is the one behind me in the living room when I do the devotionals. This is actually a G. Clay print. And I only made two. Somebody already bought number two. This is number one of two. And um, as you can see, it's on canvas. Each frame is made by Gavino. He's my framer. And uh, for this one, it goes for 1200 So that's the most, ex this is the most expensive piece that I have here. Uh, because there's only two of them other than the original that's in my living room. I also have this one. This is a G clay, but it's not on canvas. It's on what they call, um, it's a velvet paper. And it's a professional paper, they say, will last over 100 years. And uh, I actually still have the original. The original of this was on this this tile, it's not even, the original was not even painted on canvas, it was on a tile. And this goes for uh, $80 before shipping. And then I have this one, this is I Street Bridge in Sacramento. This is also on that velvet paper. As you can see, this is actually the number one out of 50 on velvet paper. The original was actually for um, Sister Phyllis. She grew up playing on that bridge in West Sacramento. And uh, yeah, it's, it's a really nice bridge. It's an old bridge. This one, I, got, I call this one the Great Commission. This is number six out of 50, let's see. Yeah. This one uh, really means a lot to me, guys. I wanted to do a painting that would show the Great Commission. And uh, let me walk this down to you. So from left to right, there's Jesus rising from the grave. 
and there's a stone that's rolled away, but it also begins a clock. Because once he opened the grave, once the stone was rolled away and he resurrected, it's like the time began for the end. And see the Holy Spirit above him kind of flowing through. See that? And this warring angel is pointing to a city on fire. And the only way to that city is through the cross. So basically, as Jesus rose from the grave, time for the end, the end times began, the clock started, the Holy Spirit is going straight to the city, the angel is pointing there, and the only way to get people out of that city is to go through those gates of hell. But that's why Jesus says, on this rock I will build my church and the gates of Hades will not prevail against it. This is one of <clears throat> a painting that means a lot to me, guys. This one right here is going for 300 before shipping. And this is not paper, this is canvas, as you can see. Now we have this one. This I call the cabin. The, the, the gallery in Stockton actually has the original to this. And the original goes for $2,000, but this one is 250. This is the number one out of 50. This is uh, also printed on that velvet paper, but it has this like, um, like a satin frame around it, custom frame. And then the last two, this one I painted for Sister Jennifer, number two out of 50. This one is for 250 before shipping. It's a pretty heavy frame. Let's see what it says. He shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water that bring forth its fruit in its season, whose leaf also shall not wither, and whatever he does shall not prosper. Psalm 1-3. Whatever he does shall prosper, not does not. Whatever he does shall prosper. And finally, last but not least, custom frame. This one's for $450. Title, The Soldier. When I make my way to the gallery in Stockton, I'll show you what I have over there. And then I have these miniatures for $25 of all my work. Look, there's the one we just saw. Here's the Great Commission. Here's one you haven't seen. Another Great Commission. There's the meeting. I sign all of these too. There's a soldier. These are $25. And this comes with this piece of wood and it comes with the stand that it's on. $25 before shipping, guys. So yeah, here's my corner. Like I said, I got to take some of these paintings to the gallery and bring some of those over here. Plus some I have at home that are not at either one. All right, guys, thanks for uh, hanging out with me.